God bless Mummy. God bless Daddy. God bless New. Amen. Forgotten someone? Who? Keep thinking. Me. I forgot to bless me. I think with, with every job you, you get to delve into a world that you, or a subject that you weren't too aware of before and it can be a real education and so it's it's nice to you know it's a pleasure to be able to learn something each job mm. and and to read the stories and the poems it was really um I'm so glad I've been introduced to them I absolutely loved it I would be read it when I at like night time and I did really enjoy it and I think every other child that knew uh, Winnie the Pooh did have a good relationship with it because it is a very enjoyable thing to be read or to read. You're going to live here, this is your new home. <laughs> Mummy says you're writing a book to stop people going to war. Mm. I think your book is a jolly good idea. You're the only one that does. I'd really like if you wrote a book for me. i definitely read it. Shall we go for a walk? Aren't you working? It doesn't seem likely. I didn't know him, or I mean, I'd heard of Winnie the Pooh. It seems like I'm talking about Al Capone. I, I'd heard of Winnie the Pooh, but uh, yeah, I, I didn't read him when I was a kid. I didn't do any of that sort of stuff. But then in the research for this film, obviously I read them and had a wonderful time. Yeah, as most children, I watched Winnie the Pooh on TV and the films, and I had a Winnie the Pooh toy, and um, it was just, one of those things that was kind of omnipresent in my childhood. He can't do all this. He's rather good at it. He's a little boy. Come on then. Where to? Home, I should think.